I'm Dave. I'm Matthew, and today we've got the multi-purpose Volkswagen multivan. That's right. We're going multi-purpose, but all the uh, traits of a Swiss Army knife all in this. We've got sleeping. We've got camping. We've got uh, family SUV. Everything going on. And a picnic table. And a picnic table. Come and take a look around this. So the 2019 Volkswagen Multivan is the short wheelbase, as you'll see down the side here. It's the T6 and all the all the fun and good looks of the California camper van, but without the pop-up roof. Taking a look around, lovely new face, very dominant Volkswagen badge, and uh, the the new chromes chrome uh, chrome effect across the front, and very much going for the, that horizontal look, which is becoming more of a Volkswagen trait. Down the side, like I said, short wheelbase, but <laughs> watch this. Both doors open, down the side, I just love it. And all at the touch of a button, very cool. So, 17 inch feet. And this is the two-wheel drive, even though there is a four-motion four uh, option available. The, it's a trade-off. The two-wheel drive has got a very, very tight uh, turning circle, but slightly less, um, I guess, slightly less road poise than the four-motion. Looking around, we'll show you inside in a minute. Matthew will show you around there. Huge big entry from the back. And... Plenty of space, regardless of the size of the family you've got, to be honest. Uh, this seat moves backwards, forwards, we'll show you all that in a minute, and turns even turns into a bed. But, huge amount of space, and really, just the, it's a mini bus, it's a multi bus, it's a multi van, it's just everything you'd need to take small, large families around, or also as a work vehicle. Uh, cool uh, dual color layer. Look at this. I actually really like it. It's it's really really vibrant really really colorful really Volkswagen actually Speaking of vibrant and colorful. Let's have a look at the uh, what's under the bonnet around the front Under this uh, I guess snub nose you can call it is a very very compact two liter twin turboed engine Come and have a look in here In there somewhere, 132 kilowatts and 400 newton meters of torque. It actually feels, it pulls really well, although it's just, you know, it's not going to break any records, uh, you know, off the mark. But it's it's really, really competent. Speaking of competent, let's speak to the uh, person who knows what's going on in the inside. Let's go and speak to Matthew. So, I'm not going to tell you much about the equipment as such in here, because... The infotainment screen, standard across the Volkswagen range, the dials, all this sort of setup is standard across the Volkswagen range, but what about the quirks specific to this van? Well, for one, there's the storage spaces, and there's plenty of it, and when I say plenty, I'm in fact understating it. You've got one over here, a couple of cup holders there, and a big bottle holder over there. You've got a storage bin on the top which is lined with a very soft felt lovely you've got one in there which uh, hides your USB port and the aux input for the radio and of course the glove box big as it is and again lined in felt then we get to the door bins these are just massive so you get one storage space up here which is rubber lined as well to keep stuff in place and then you get a storage space down here which will hold two bottles and Volkswagen has been very kindly very kind to provide us with this rubbish bin so that way your kids won't be leaving any trash around in the car yes they will <laughs> well not if your dad tells them not to <laughs> right enough with the front let's take a look at the piece de resistance all the tables and stuff in the back right so there's five seats in the back of this car and if you want to feed those five hungry people without creating much of a mess Volkswagen will also provide you with 
a little picnic table to feed them with. Now this can be height adjusted. There you go. And you can pull these two bits out. All right. And you can pull these two bits out for more area. How about that? You can even have a conference back here. Well, this table is not just a flat surface for playing cards or, I don't know, playing video games these days because kids don't really play cards anymore. You get cup holders hidden in here. You get a storage space in here with two smaller bins or ashtrays if you smoke. You get space for your magazines or more likely going to be iPads these days. And then you get on this side another storage bin and a little cubby in there. Very practical. So this table is very nifty I guess you could say. But how about those chairs? Let's take a look at those. Like the van in general, this seat is also multi-purpose. So firstly, you get armrests, one on each side. You can move the seat back and forth using the lever over here. And this over here will fold the seat, but What's even more interesting and why the seat is turned in this direction is that there's a little lever on the front here which you can pull to rotate the seat. So you can enjoy, sit here and enjoy the beautiful view of the beach over there. Or if you're not very good with traveling backwards, you can turn the seat all the way around and face forward just like the people in the front. But if you've had enough of sitting for one day, this rear bench here will convert into a bed and we will show you how. So how do you turn the back of this car into your bedroom? Well, the first thing you want to do is fold these seats down. That can be done through this lever over here. Drop them down like that and then show you how to turn this back bench into a bed. Come with me around the back. So in the back over here, pop this one up. Don't need that. And there are two little hoops here. So number two is the one that you want to pull if you want to bring this seat backwards. So want to push it forward, yeah. or if you want to push it forward. Yep. Now with the seats moved forward, you want to pull lever number one, and that'll fold this flat. There you go, and voila. You have a bed for three people. Perfect for a night of camping. Well, enough with all these folding and pulling bits. It is a car and you got to drive it. So let's see how this van drives. Okay, so the multi, multi, multi van from Volkswagen, it really yeah, there's a lot of multis going on. I mean, it really does fit so much into a short vehicle or short weight wheel based vehicle. Uh, vehicle. That's a lot of vehicles yeah. too. One, two, three. Yeah, exactly. For the multi van. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's it's great for the family. It's great for work. It's great for camping. It's just quite literally great. Also, if you want to just, I guess, hide things in general or use it as another cupboard, there's great for storage as well. Yeah, so storage is good. The the drive itself, it's comfortable. There's armrests for for both drivers and passengers, and passengers and passengers. There's so <laughs> many things. There's um, it's it's a comfortable, comfortable ride. It's a comfortable, comfortable, comfortable ride because there's three <laughs> rows of seats and it's comfortable in all of them. You're right. The uh, personally, I would go for the four motion just for that extra bit of stability. But um, you can't deny the, the the turning circle that comes with this two wheel drive. It will just turn on the proverbial dime, really. I think we say it's you know not a very long car, but at the end of the day, this is a van which seats seven people. So it's no hatchback in terms of its length, but it turns so well and it just feels. It doesn't feel like it's that long really no it's actually uh, from a driver again from a driver's point of view 
it feels easy to maneuver we've taken it to the shopping mall today we've taken it uh, to the beach we've it, it certainly have enough space for everything everything you want but also I don't feel I mean it gets inside those white lines of a of a shopping mall within reason and certainly the sliding doors at the back are great and I love the way that you can open them <laughs> with the, the key fob and all those sort of things is very cool uh, the engine pulls really nicely um, those 400 Newton meters really do go uphill we can you chase whoever you want from there and like I say it's 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 a bit floaty have to say around the corners you do have to respect the fact that it is a van but uh, I think fully laden with the family I think it will squat really nicely yeah it's just all around it's just a great van utility vehicle car SUV everything frankly it's a multi-purpose vehicle and it really uh, the other thing is we, we saw somebody else in a <laughs> multi-van coming the other way Volkswagen drivers do wave at each other they it's, gave us a very friendly wave of acknowledgement it even had the same color scheme red and white it's a fact <laughs> <laughs> so there you have it Volkswagen's multi 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 van it really is the Swiss army knife of vehicles Thanks, thanks, thanks for watching. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you subscribe, subscribe. It sounds like we're in an echo. <laughs> there will be more. More, more, more. <laughs> Cheers.